Now he wants me to explain how you cash in on those experiences. The, uh, the other side, heaven. See, we'll have an avatar that is perfect. So much more perfect than the one we're running around in. But even more so is we'll be able to, anybody ever seen on Star Trek where they go on the holodeck and everything is like changed and you're in this time period? That doesn't even come close. You'll be able to smell. And you'll be able to pick the person's emotions that you want to feel, that they're feeling at that time. It is the most in-depth VR you could possibly imagine. You will feel like you and smell and everything like you're really back here in the nursery. And so when you get there and you see your relatives, you'll be able to say, hey, come here. I want you to see this and you'll be able to show them that experience that you had and they'll be able to experience your feelings in that and your sensations. They'll even smell it. So I'm run without the smell on because it's not pleasant. <laughs> but that's God's gift to us. And even better so, you can go back into a time and say, for example, there's something in your past that is really important. You can capture that, come out of the holodeck, go back to your room and recreate it. Sorry, angels only and above. And so, nothing is never truly lost in the nursery. Everything you have ever experienced will be available to you there too. Every treasure that you've had on your path. You know, some of you have had fires and the whole house burnt down. Me personally, we had the flood of 93 that took out my yearbook at my mom's house, my high school yearbook. And uh, a few other things that were very valuable to me that was gonna come to me as soon as I was ready and my mom passed away. Never got to me, but they're not lost. I will be able to make an exact replica. And so, you will too. Yeah, actually you all will because angels only after this Christmas. No more White Walkers. You either figure out how to live right or the gates of heaven will be closed to you. That is the bad part about this. There will be no more white walkers accepted into heaven. And that's part of the reason of the me being here. You got enough faith and logic to know alone there's a ton of logic. So 
So, hopefully that's going to be enough for the world to 100% give it to God. If not, you obviously won't be picking me up tomorrow. And we're going to do the rapture route. <laughs> but I have faith. I know there's, I wish I could say I do know for a fact there's billions of you that, but I don't know how many are in the loop. But I seriously hope that 100% of you that are in the loop understands and knows that you have an eternal life. All you got to do is want it and follow God. I guess that's it for now. Sometimes I just think these little bits and pieces bug the heck out of me. I wish I'd just sit here for two hours and tell you everything. But he says, I can't handle that. I'm, uh, I'm still on a need to know basis. And, uh, so are you. He says he's got some really cool cards to play this week, though whole bunch more logic to be thrown down. It's going to be cool. It's going to be cool. St. Patrick, Christ the second, second son, second king, signing off.